So here we have another Alpha 159. We've got quite a few of these at the moment. And the reason why is because they've been such great cars for us as a dealership. They're reliable, economical and great value for money. This car is black with black leather interior. It's got the 2.4 litre turbo diesel engine, is fully automatic and has travelled just 91,000 kilometres from you. It's also got two remote keys to it and this car's in very good condition, especially for a black car. It's got the original factory mats, it's got Bluetooth, the air conditioning's ice cold, and the TI came with bigger wheels, a number of other features. It's got nice big brakes. As I said, I did drive it earlier and it does drive beautifully. Even things like the wheels are in very good condition. The 2.4 litre turbo diesel engine is significantly better than the smaller 1.9 litre. If you're looking at a smaller Alfa Romeo, like the 147 series, the 1.9 litre is more than adequate, but I think for a four-door sedan like this one, you want that little bit of extra power. All the tools are there. The car was built and complied in 2009, which is great. Sometimes some of these European cars are built one year and complied the next year or even a year later. The 2.4 litre also came with the twin exhaust system at the back. Looking down the sides, it, it appears to me to be gun barrel straight. I can't see any dents in the car whatsoever. They used to be only available in Selly speed, whereas now you've actually got three options. You've got your six speed manual transmission, your fully automatic, and there is a Selly speed available as well. Um, however, we certainly don't see many of them and I don't believe many were sold. They were a bit of a troublesome gearbox. Alpha have come a long way. And for me, I think that the Alpha 159 is their best sedan yet. It looks absolutely fantastic. And I think we've got to a point now where all people really want from a car is reliability, style, good value, and reasonable running costs. I'm not going to say cheap, because if you wanted a cheap car to run, you'd probably buy a new Hyundai or a Toyota Echo. The major service on this particular car is basically a new timing belt. Every 60 to 100,000 kilometres, depending on the engine. And uh, depending on whether you go to a dealership or an Alfa Romeo specialist, that could be anywhere from $1,000 to $1,500 in the whole scheme of things, we're really not talking about that much money. So thanks so much for watching our video today. We have, I believe, four Alpha 159s in stock at the present time, from sedans to a wagon. Thank you so much for watching, and we look forward to hearing from you.